Hi, I'm Lou Barlow. I'm from Dinosaur Jr., Sebado, Full Complosion. I'm here at Amoeba Records, and they've been kind enough to let me pick out some records and put them in my bag. The first thing I found is this. It's Blotto. I'm not sure where they're from. I think it's like New York State. This record was like, it was on college radio when I was a very young kid, when I was first discovering new music. And there's a song called I Wanna Be a Lifeguard on this record, which is awesome. It's really funny, they were kind of a joke band, kind of a new wave joke band. Never saw them play, but I'm really psyched to have this record. So this is one of the only real new ones I got, but I've been curious about this guy, everybody loves him. I don't know, Ty Segal. I figured like a good, a singles compilation was a good place to start. It's a double record. It comes with a digital download. Psyched about that. This is Evergreen. They are from Louisville, Kentucky. Um, the drummer was in Slint. It's a group of guys from Louisville, a lot of really talented musicians. They all kind of drifted from band to band and they all kind of alighted briefly as this band, Evergreen, who opened up for my band Sebado back in the day and blew us off the stage. A really incredible kind of soulful, uh, Kind of very spare record, but like rocking, like really got a really great rock and vocalist. Like it's a pretty lame description, but it's this really good record, and you really should hear it. And it's only eight bucks, so no one knows about it. Uh, this might not be a great record, but it is one of the first records that I ever bought. I've long since lost it. When I, I sold all of my records to buy hardcore records back in 1981, 82, this was one of the victims. <laughs> This band, The Elevators, were actually from Northampton, Massachusetts. I'm from Westfield, Massachusetts, where I grew up. They were a new wave band that got signed to Arista Records. So this thing was like as a cutout with this exact sticker on it all over at every record store where I lived. And I saw it, it was like just kind of like the Blotto record, like you gotta have this. It's like this is a little piece of my, my uh, musical history, you know, and a little piece of like my regional past as well. Uh, now this. This song is called um, Major Tom. It's a German artist. It actually came out as a German version, obviously in Germany and Europe. But this song, you'd know it if you heard it. It's great. The, it has the, the chorus is, Earth below us, drifting, falling. You know, that song, this song is so good. And I finally have the English version of it. All right, this is a record that I absolutely adore, and I haven't gotten it on vinyl yet. Today, this is one that I was really looking forward to finding today. It's an Unknown Mortal Orchestra. This record probably came out two years ago. I've been listening to it ever since. Great record, totally interesting band. They got another record out now too, titled Unknown Mortal Orchestra 2. <laughs> now this, I'm actually in this band. This is an employee pick at Amoeba Records. Now usually employee picks at Amoeba Records scare the shit out of me because they're always like, it's kind of experimental, it's just too cool for school stuff. I always buy a bunch of it and I get it home and I don't like it. But this, this is my band. This is my band, The Full Complosion, it's our first our first album that we put out, and it's one of my favorite records that I've ever made. I only have like, I think, I'm not even sure if I have a CD copy of this record. That's me back in 94, something like that, it's a while ago. Would you ever do another folk composition record? Uh, well, this guy, John Davis, he stopped talking to me a long time ago. <laughs> I mean, we didn't have a fight or anything. He just kind of split. But he's got a new—he's got a new solo record coming out, and I had to get this because I got kids.
your arms down when you get to school. And my girlfriend told me, like, we gotta get this. You know, it's a Christmas story, everybody loves it. It's really fun, right? Everybody knows all the scenes from it, it's great. He heard it from your son! What? 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 And since Amoeba has everything, I got that too. So that's it. Things have changed. Oh,